Hello everyone, I'm Xuan Wenhuang and I'm excited to share our work titled Can GNN be good adapter for LLMs? This paper focuses on text attribute graphs. In this graph, node feature are textual data. TAG is widespread in real-world scenarios such as social networks, molecular networks. Modern TAGs benefit various applications such as alarming detection, recommendation, and user classification. Our question is how to model TAG with the core challenge being how to model its texture and structure data. Look at prior solutions. Cascading GNN and language model is a feasible method. This approach first obtains node representations from pre-trained language models based on the corresponding texture data and then conducts end-to-end -end learning with GNNs. Some other methods have proposed using structured data to supervise pre-trained language models, allowing PLMs to in directly incorporate graph information. However, both of them involve fine-tuning language models, making them difficult to scale up to binary-scale models like LAMA2 and GPT-3. Furthermore, we believe that graph structure can enrich texture features through language modeling. For example, structured data can be used to infer a user's preference even if they are not mentioned in the profile. To address these limitations, we propose Graph Adapter. It treats GNN as adapter for LLMs, similar to LoRa. The LLM is folded, and the final output of the language model is justified by the trainable GNN adapter. The GNN adapter introduces only a few trainable parameters and can be trained with low computational costs. Then we use unlabeled texture data to supervise the learning of adapter, incorporating graph-aware adapters and LLMs to predict the next token. Once the adapter is trained, we can combine this framework with different task-specific prompts for various downstream tasks. We conduct experiments on three real-world datasets. And the results show that the graph adapter can be combined with large language models to achieve advanced performance in TAG modeling. Thanks for your listening.